Bonjour, hello, and welcome to Max Mountain World. One four Sierra Whiskey zero zero seven calling CQDX. Bonjour, hello, welcome to the Man Cave. Welcome to the Max Mountain World Global Headquarters. I was going to do a couple of outdoorsy videos the next couple of days, but I've been bit on the ankle by something and I have allergies for stuff like that so I've got an ankle up like a balloon and I won't go into the the other effects but yeah yucky so I'm gonna do a couple of indoorsy ones instead of outdoorsy ones the first one here is I just want to cover something uh, the calling frequencies on freeband now we all know on the radio, those of us that do this, all the nonsense that goes on. We know about all the, you know, all the music players, the people who chat incessantly on the calling frequency. Some of those do it inadvertently. Some of them, you can just catch them in between the chats and say, clear the call frequency, please. Do it nicely, usually they will. Sometimes they're doing it out of devilment. Two guys, you know, a couple of hundred yards apart, pumping a couple of hundred watts at each other, deliberately causing hassle. You can't do anything with them. Just ignore them. It's like any, anyone causing hassle. The Coca-Cola, Pepsi-Cola squad. You know what I'm talking about there. Just ignore them. I don't react to this stuff anymore. I'll, I'll politely ask someone to clear the calling frequency once, maybe twice. If it carries on, I'll just put out a huge secure call over whatever's going on. Drag people away. I do have a point to this. Uh, recently, at the start of this year, people started coming back onto radio. Hams started getting their gear out again. Freebanders started coming back on, CBers, and I've noticed on the, the cluster sites uh, that there's a lot of shortwave listeners coming back on as well, and this is amplified with the recent global situation with people in various countries all around the world being confined, so they've dug out the radios at the attic and everything, and it's been getting really busy. Now, we're very lucky on 11 metres, we have a huge band. Not many people actually on it know it, let alone use it. But we have the whole of 27 megahertz. We have the whole of 26 megahertz. And we have the most part of 25 megahertz. Most of it is confined to 27.4 to 27.6, which is between the UK frequencies and the rest of the world frequencies, and now the UK frequencies too, for CBs. So outside of that, the, it's, it's not really used that much. And you find everything crammed into this one section with its 27.555 calling frequency. And it just goes berserk. Every time the propagation's open, it goes daft. And I hear things that are just so daft on that calling frequency. Never mind what happens elsewhere and stuff. The other calling frequency down 26 megahertz, which a lot of us are trying to promote now because it is a fantastic part of the band, is down at 26.285, all on upper side band, mostly on upper side band. So the, this lower side band gets used, as FM gets used, as AM gets used. Most of it is an upper side band, although when things get quiet, it's worth a look around on lower side because you will find some stuff from faraway countries. That's by the by. So anyway, putting out a call, using that call frequency. There's so many things. The main thing is, is to keep it simple and keep it clear. Use what I call clear words. Don't use words of the, I mean, there's the phonetic alphabet. Yes, use it, but don't use the country phonetic alphabet. The main phonetic alphabet, Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, Delta, Echo, Fox, Trot. Don't use America, Bra Brazil, Canada. You know, if you're putting out your call sign, say you're an Alpha Charlie, you put out uh, America, Canada as your call sign, people are, might only catch part of that and think, oh, there's America. There. You know, it's, it's confusion. Keep it simple, keep it clear. So there's all sorts of other stuff goes on. You have to tell people what you're doing. Sometimes putting, putting out a call 
for just someone local. People do that in cities and things. Put out CQDX. CQ is a clear word. It's not like ever or something, you know. CQ, DX. You don't need to modify them. You don't need to dog x-ray. You don't need to delta x-ray. You don't need to David x-ray. DX works fine. It's known all over the world in the radio. Same as CQ. 11 meters, yes. Sometimes people come from other bands and whatnot and they forget they're there. I do hear the odd am amateur call sign getting put out and I'll soon correct them and say, look, you're in the wrong place, mate. So, yeah, use 11 meters as well. So, I have one way of doing things and it works and it's worked for me for over 40 years. I'll demonstrate a call out and a couple of other things associated with that at the, the tail end of this video. So just to strip down a little further <laughs> the, the, the common CQ call. This is only what I do. I'm not telling anyone what to do but I'm just saying this is what I do and this is what I think is an efficient way of getting contacts and not bunging up the whole system. You can give out your call sign. We have a recognised set of call signs here. The first two numbers, your country. The second two numbers, either something you've made up or your radio club. And the third is either a number you've made up or the radio club has allocated a number to you. So that starts off uh, from number one in Italy. Now this dates back uh, to a certain group of Italian people who collectively are... Uh, known by a word that starts with the letter M, you could say. And they kind of took this uh, as a, a means of communication. And if you look at the first few digits, you'll see what I mean. Number one, Italy. Number two, the US of A. And then what was going on down, down in South America? Brazil, four, Argentina, you know. Just look at it, it's pretty obvious. And it, it went down so far and then it went as the amateur free band, what used to be called Pirates, thing kind of exploded. And it now goes up to, I think it's uh, 354 I think now, but there's been quite a lot deleted and updated and stuff. So put out that number, put out your call. You don't need to say you're from Ireland or from Scotland or Venezuela. It's in your call sign. Waste of time actually saying, oh, I am 108 Charlie Delta from Scotland. You've already said it. It's like I'm from Scotland, I'm from Scotland. Waste of time. Bungs up the system. So you, you put out your CQ call calling CQDX. You're calling for a distance call. DX is a clear word. Use it. Don't say dog x-ray and all that, as I've already mentioned. So, one thing to do as well is to follow a certain format. Have a look around and find a free frequency. Listen to it for a few seconds. Whatever's on the calling frequency will wait for you. It'll still be running. It'll still be going. Listen to that for a little while. And then key up. Is this frequency in use? Leave it a few seconds. 10, 20 seconds again. Do it again. Is this frequency in use? Then it's not in use. Great. Remember it. Go back. Put your call out. Take people immediately away to there. Don't leave an open call on the calling frequency unless things are absolutely dead propagation wise. Sometimes it's good to do that. If there is very limited uh, noise around the band and the call frequency especially, put your call out and leave it there because this, it's not bunging up anything. But when it gets busy, Take them away straight away. QSY. Use the Q codes. The Q codes started out from military and the hams adapted it as their own. Free banders and everything now adapt it as our own as well. We don't use everything, but uh, this dates way back. But use it, you know. So put out your call. Keep it simple. Keep it clear. And tell people what you're doing. Tell people what you want to do. Go into a frequency, you know, QSY to frequency so-and-so, so-and-so. Bang, that's all you need to do, you're gone. You can say you're gone just to make sure instead of the old over, you can say I'm gone or whatever, you know, and that way they know, right, the guy's away. You then land up on that frequency. Give it a few seconds. Listen, maybe someone will actually beat you there and they'll say, hey, blah, 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 whatever, you know, and then you've got the conversation going. And you've got more to speak about if you haven't already announced it on the calling frequency, oh, I'm from Southwest Ireland or whatever. 
Um, I'm not thinking of anyone in particular here, you know, you know uh, you, that gives you more to talk about once you've got the QSO going. You know, I'm from South West Ireland, I'm from County blah blah blah, whatever. It's not choked up the calling frequency. So you, you're then there, you're on that frequency, you go on, if you don't hear anything, whatever, put out your CQ call, QRZ, give me your call sign in other words, QRZ DX, uh, this is blah 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 blah, and say standing by and listening and that way they know it's the end of that over as it were you're standing by and listening bang let's have a call in for there the, the, whoever's going to shout on you if anything do that once twice three times if it's sort of semi busy stay there and put out a general secure call you know that someone's going to be stand, scanning around and they're going to find you someone's going to put a call into you or whatever but you know don't choke up the calling frequency more than you is really necessary so I'll go on to this in a little minute, I'll show exactly what I do with it and, uh, and that's that, I'll do that in the rollout of this little video. So up on the triple five, this virtually never happens on the 26285. I'll zoom in a little bit and uh, let's, let's do some critique on this lot. Into the radio we go. Right. That incidentally is my homemade tone adjuster. I did a video on it. Also keeps the dust out of the speaker. But anyway, we've got a budding DJ here. Here is someone who's bored with their hobby because they don't have the imagination and or the equipment to actually make it interesting for themselves so they just set up to brass everyone else off. Yeah. Unfortunately this uh, poor soul, they're just, ex uh, they're just attention seeking, it's uh, a kiddie mentality. Can't really do anything about it except the minute it finishes, the instant it finishes, blast out a, a CQ call and carry on business as usual. See what else is happening now that that guy's gone away. So, point of contention is whistling. Quite often, uh, I mean, every time I fire up my radio, I check my, my tuning mess, WR. And the easiest way to do that is a quick. <laughs> and you can look at the, the SWR meter, then carry on with your call. So. Baker Radio Canada. Now, someone in the distance, not very well of English, might hear, Oh, Canada! Ah. Well done. What else we got? That's my mate Paul, he's getting that right. Simple, clear, get out of there. And Paul's an operator that's been on for 40 plus years like myself and I know for a fact he's checked out that frequency before he took people there. Very, very good operator. Then we have Why QRZ onto the, you know, why invite people to go onto there to answer you? Take them away. Why? That's an old guy in the northwest of England somewhere. He does that out the blue every day, all the time. He's just encouraging the Spaniards that started it off in the 1980s. Coca-Cola is not for 11 metres, please stop doing this. Good one. Yeah, QRZ, DX, QRZ, DX, 108, 
Belgium radio. He's not in Belgium. He's in 108. He's in Scotland. Why confuse people? someone ticking him off. As usual, thanks very much for watching and uh, remember to subscribe down there, click on the alert bell for notifications of future uploads from Max Mountain World. Remember you can comment, put comments down there, you can like it, you can dislike it, whatever. Feedback is so so much appreciated on this channel. Subscriptions. I'm going for subscriptions now. The more subscriptions, the more audience, the more encouragement, the more feedback. It's like a beautiful ball that keeps rolling on. So, as I say, thanks very, very much for watching. Until the next video, ciao! Is this frequency in use? Is this frequency in use? CQ, CQ, CQDX, CQ 11 meters, CQDX. This is 14 Sierra Whiskey 007. 14 Sierra Whiskey 007 QSY frequency 27.575 27.575 This is 14 Sugar Whiskey 007 We're going 27.575 We go!